Hey guys, Innovative Thinking here, and today I'm going to attempt to build a steam engine using only hand tools and these basic parts. If you're unfamiliar with how a steam engine works, this is a quick overview. Pressurized steam enters through here. As there's a path, it can push the piston out, and this air is exhausted through here. And when this moves this way, the valve can move in this direction, which now allows the steam to flow through here, pushing the piston the other way and this air can be exhausted through there. Here's a diagram I made for my engine, and you can see this is the valve, and this is the cylinder with the piston in it. Faster! Faster! If you want to bend pipe without kinking it, just tape one end closed, fill it with sand, tape the other end closed, and then you should bend it without any kinks. With everything cut out, it's time to start drilling some holes. I'm using a quarter as the cap for the cylinder. You can put a wet paper towel on your old solder joints so they don't melt. To make the piston, I cut off a piece of pipe with the same diameter as my cylinder and I smeared the walls with some oil and I'm going to fill it with JB Weld. That better not get stuck. This is the finished valve, cylinder, and piston. The piston will go in here, and the valve will go in here. To balance it the rest of the way, I'll drill holes where it's heavier. Pretty, isn't it? Perfectly balanced, this whole thing should be.
I added some supports to make sure they're moving in and out straight. All finished. You can get it to run from just your breath, but it doesn't go very fast. Soon I'll make a boiler so it can run off his steam but for now it's vacuum powered. 